Is it just me? Or have things gotten super weirder since we ice super shot? It's not just you. Heads up, literally. That's Fritz, the amusement park mascot. But how did he get here? More importantly, why would anyone make a park for amusement? Look out, robot dog! Wait, robot dog? That is definitely not from around here. to get to the Mega Wash HQ if the streets don't cooperate. It's kind of like playing a video game. Except I'm pretty sure we don't get extra lives. Is this part of Navard's plan? We don't know. He's got a Tetra Flame amplifier at the top of the Ultimate Garage, but... We can't be sure if these glitches are part of it or a byproduct. T-Riders. What is with Hot Wheels City today? Everything seemed chill, so Mom G sent me out to stock up on some snacks, and suddenly the streets are crazy! Check out this giant beach ball! DM me or shout out in the chat if any of you know what's up with this insanity. He's causing a rift in the space continuum! Uh, what? what? How do you know? The glitches. They aren't just things from Hot Wheels City. They're things from who knows where, or when. Take the giant shark. Species that large have been extinct for a hundred million years. Pretty fierce for a hundred million years old. Navard must be trying to bring something even bigger here to take over all of Hot Wheels City. We've got to stop him. Then we're going to need a blast of fast. Challenge accepted. <laughs> I've always wanted to say that. Things are beginning to annoy me. At least the shark's still frozen. You had to sit. Told you we should have had sushi. The shark's hurting us toward the scorpion. <laughs> they are working together. Then we've got to split them up. Yes, pit them against each other. Bingo. Elliot, you take it. Look out, you big ape. I'm coming for you! <laughs> Quinn, the scorpion. Draven, the dragon. And Sophia and I will take the super shark. The fastest for the lastest. Meet up at the sharking lot. Traction tires. Woohoo!
this shark bait needs a blast of that. And he's going for it. Hook, line, and sinker. One moment we're trying to stop Navarre, and the next we're here. <sighs> this dimension, that dimension, doesn't matter. We can't let Navarre get away with this. Oh, Navarre, 
We have to find him and figure out how to get back. What? Huh? Tell me where I am. Wherever you are isn't where I am. This Hot Wheel City is a lot bigger than ours. But maybe not completely different. Let's try meeting up someplace we all know, like the Mega Tower Car Wash. It could work. Great idea. Hope I can find it. See you there. Doing this backwards tool again. Who is that speedster? Uh, you okay? Who, Who are, are you? you? Quinn? Quinn? No, no, you're not. not. I am. Oh, yeah? Then what's the optimum gear ratio for turbocharged independent nitro engines? Huh? Who cares? I just want to go fast. You look like me, but you sound more like Sophia. Okay, this looks sort of familiar. The Mega Tower Car Wash should be just past... <gasps> Who do you think you are? Me? You can't be me because me would never do that. Why not? It's fun. It's not very efficient if you're trying to drive fast. Fast? Now you're speaking my language. I seriously doubt that. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> wow. The Mega Tower car wash looks the same back in our universe. Don't worry, I've made some major software upgrades. I don't believe we've met. <laughs> or have we? Check it out! I have an alternate universe twin! Doppelganger. We all do. <laughs> Whatever. Hey, I like her. Wait, where's Elliot? Elliot? Why would you want to know where Elliot is in any universe? He's our friend? Not in this world he's not. In this world he works for an evil genius, Nivard. What? what? The, the evil, evil clone? clone? Wait, how do you know about Nivard? We trapped him using our Tetra Flame. We'll explain later. We gotta warn Elliot, our Elliot. Okay, but first we gotta find him. On it! Twins? Clones are so in right now. I still can't figure out. 
figure out how we ended up in a parallel universe. I'm guessing you drove through a wormhole of some kind. What do you remember? <laughs> Navard stole our Tetra Flame. And led you on a high-speed chase that brought you here. How do you know that? We thought we were trapping him and his beasts, not sending them to another Hot Wheel city. We used a gateway that was powered by the Tetra Flame to stop Navard's evil takeover of our city. We hoped he'd be stuck forever. Sorry to be the bearers of bad news, but... Navard is back! <gasps> We'd better find Elliot. Mm -hmm. I kind of recognize this area. Maybe I'm close to the Mega Tower car wash. Wow! That's the ultimate, ultimate garage. Eh, like it? Huh, who wouldn't? Huh? Whoa, whoa, hold up. Is your name Elliot? What? How? That's crazy! <laughs> Elliot, this is like having a twin brother, but better! Yes! Whoa! Elliot, we gotta go! <laughs> no worries, Elliot. He's with us. Us? Yeah. You, me, and... Navard? before he falls into the wrong hands. Then we need a, a blast, blast of fast. <gasps> Jinx! Ugh, unbelievable. You said it. I can't believe you're working with Navard, Elliot. Is that a problem, Elliot? Um, where are you going? I, I just remembered I left a, a, a cheeseburger in the wa washing machine. <laughs> I'm more of a burrito guy myself. Draven! Oh, so cool you're back. You gotta help me talk more sense into Elliot. He's working with Navard. That makes two of us. Wait, what? Either join us or... Or be rescued? So fast! Oh no! Ha ha! Let's go, Elliot! While wow, that dino is busy with evil Elliot! Not the car! Dino Head! It's me! Oh no! I'm on your side! Stop! <sighs> He's parking on the other side of the street now. The bad side. <laughs> and as you can see, I have every car you'd ever want. A monopoly on awesomeness. 
Isn't it the coolest, Drave Man? Impressive. It seems I've made a wise alliance. But tell me, what happened to my twin? Your Hot Wheels City's Draven. Our Draven invented the Tetra Flame powered wormhole device, allowing us to drive to parallel universes. Yeah, totally. Then he cloned himself into Navard and, like, took off to explore. My twin is an evil genius. Yeah, up to a point. But enough about the past. Come up to the roof and see my new friend. <laughs> okay, here's the plan. Team Awesome. The chases, Quinn and me. Lookout and diversion. We'll keep the bad guys occupied. While Team Awesomer, Twin Quinn, Sophia, and Elliot sneak into the ultimate garage compound and plant spy cams. So we can figure out what makes that place tick and how to shut Navarre down. <laughs> Why am I Twin Quinn and not Quinn Quinn? Because you lost at rock, paper, scissors. Can we focus? Awesome! <laughs> Is everybody seeing this? Draven is helping Navard. This is terrible. And totally predictable. Hey, look down a floor. It's Evil Elliot. He's going into Navard's lab. I wonder what's in there. Let's find out. Team Awesome, you ready to sneak in once the laser fence is down? Be on the lookout for Navard's giant friends. Got it. Ready. Then here goes nothing. Did you see that? Headlights. Come and get us. Go and get them. Navard took the bait. The beams are down. This is our shot! And... We're in! Okay, we'll keep these creatures busy as long as we can! fish before. Follow me. As long as I'm on your tail and not his. Elliot, you're making me sick. <laughs> Sorry, Elliot. Should have thought of that before you became a bad guy. Love to keep messing with you, Tall Blue and Harry, but we've got work to do. Last one off the gorilla's a broken carburetor. <laughs> You're on! Yeah! Well, we tied again. <laughs> First one to set up their spy cams wins. You're on! There is 
no slime or giant monsters running amok in Hot Wheels City. I guess that's not technically new. Oh, and local heroes Chase and Elliot have jobs delivering hamburgers for Burger Dash, which, again, is not really news. But on the plus side, still no slime or monsters. You get a burger, and you get a burger, and you get a burger, and you get a burger. 370, that's a record, bro. Ha! 369, gunning for your crown, Chase. Best not miss when you come at the king. That didn't count. I could use a burger. Love me some pickles. Not my jam. More of a melted cheese man. A code to doo doo alert. I think I know what happened to the pigeon, Sheriff. Pickles. No, I'm pretty sure it's more than a bad food allergy. I found barrels of slime at Burger Dash. It must have been left over from the last time Draven slimed the city. And we've been delivering burgers with it all over the city. The pigeon must have eaten one. Wait a sec. You boys deliver? Oh, good to know. Uh, now, if you'll excuse me, I got a really big bird to deal with. <laughs> we gotta get those burgers back before everyone eats them. Pickles. of the space-time continuum? Oh, yeah. Pretty basic stuff. Just asking for Elliot. Pickles. What's up, guys? That. We could really use a brainy, pragmatic astro-engineer right about now. First, we gotta catch that bird. And I know just the thing. What do you call that big space ray thingy again? It's an interdimensional mutated avian microsizer. Huh? Run that by me again? Pigeon Trinker. Way catchier name. Just saying. You guys lure the pigeon into the open so I can get a clear shot. Roger, Dodger. Hey, bird brain. Come get some more yummy slime. You've got to get it away from the buildings. I know exactly where to go. A place pigeons find irresistible. That's right, you big flying rat. A nice statue. You know what to do. Small is beautiful. Now what are we going to do about all the slime? Pickles. And Elliot. There's only one person who can help us. Someone who knows slime inside and out. Whoa! No! You cannot be serious. Which is not something you hear on the news every day. A 
Unless you live in Hot Wheels City. Hey, Quinn. You know what's more fun than a bunch of zombies crashing into everything? No. What? Literally everything. Heck oh. So what's the plan again? Draven made the slime. He's going to help us get rid of it. Uh, Draven's not usually super helpful. Really more of an insane evil genius type guy. Plus, isn't he in some sort of zero-g prison? Leave that to me. So, what sort of brilliant high-tech plan do you have to break Draven out? Probably some quantum phys ed type stuff, huh? Something like that. Stay right behind me. Draven, get in! Hey, what's up? We're busting you out of here if you stop the slime. Uh, Quinn, we got hot zombie fuzz. Brace yourselves, I'm punching the black hole donut duster. I knew she'd have some kind of brilliant high tech plan. Pickles, wait, did you say black hole? <laughs> Raven, we freed you. Now make us some slime antidote. Ooh, hey. What's up? The effects of prolonged zero-G may have altered his brain chemistry. And definitely not the fact that we just drove through a black hole. The only thing that can reverse zero-G scramble brains is the super driver's testing loop. Just need to get past all those zombies. How did they even get their license? I'll draw them off. Get to the loop. What the? Might have to get my wheels rebalanced. Got that nice, fresh zombie car smell. I think Draven's had enough testing with action. What's your name? Uh, Quinn Cosmic. Hmm, he still seems to be suffering from zero G. You're Draven. Evil genius? Do you remember anything that would help us reverse the slime? Anything at all? Think! Hmm. Nope. Not ringing any bells. Pickles! No, buddy. Those aren't pickles. Those are just a bunch of barrels of zombie reversing slime hidden beneath a tarp. Zombie reversing serum? Draven must have hidden it for himself. Well, that's shockingly convenient. But why did he hide it here? Who cares? Let's get this antidote out there. One City D-Slime. Good to have you back. I'm hungry. Can we get burgers? I want extra pickles. Uh, how about pizza? New news! There is no slime or giant monsters running amok in Hot Wheels City. I guess that's not technically new. Oh, and local heroes Chase and Elliot have jobs delivering hamburgers for Burger Dash, which... Again, is not really news, but on the plus side, still no slime or monsters. You get a burger, and you get a burger, and you get a burger, and you get a burger. 370, that's a record, bro. Ha! 369, 
Gunning for your crown chase. Best not miss when you come at the king. That didn't count. a burger. Love me some pickles. Not my jam. More of a melted cheese man. Uh-oh. A new news newsflash. Forget what I said about slime and monsters. We got them. Better take cover. We got us a code two doo doo alert. I think I know what happened to the pigeon, Sheriff. Pickles. No, I'm pretty sure it's more than a bad food allergy. I found barrels of slime at Burger Dash. It must have been left over from the last time Draven slimed the city. And we've been delivering burgers with it all over the city. The pigeon must have eaten one. Wait a sec. You boys deliver? Oh, good to know. Uh, now, if you'll excuse me, I got a really big bird to deal with. <laughs> we gotta get those burgers back before everyone eats them. Pickles. of the space-time continuum? Oh, yeah. Pretty basic stuff. Just asking for Elliot. Pickles. What's up, guys? That. We could really use a brainy, pragmatic astro-engineer right about now. First, we gotta catch that bird. And I know just the thing. What do you call that big space ray thingy again? It's an interdimensional mutated avian microsizer. Huh? Run that by me again? Pigeon Trinker. Way catchier name. Just saying. You guys lure the pigeon into the open so I can get a clear shot. Roger, Dodger. Hey, bird brain. Come get some more yummy slime. You've got to get it away from the buildings. I know exactly where to go. A place pigeons find irresistible. That's right, you big flying rat. A nice statue. You know what to do. Small is beautiful. Now what are we gonna do about all the slime? Pickles. And Elliot. There's only one person who can help us. Someone who knows slime inside and out. Whoa! No! You cannot be serious. New news! Draven, Hot Wheel City's resident evil genius, is having a birthday bash and inviting his giant toxic monster pals. What could possibly go wrong? What? Draven's getting back together with his toxic monster pals? Yeah, it's his birthday, and he said those are his only friends. And they're not toxic anymore. Everyone got the antidote, remember? I don't know about this, Chase. And what about the bouncy castle? There's gonna be a bouncy castle? Awesome! Oh, don't worry, my pets. You will soon be monstrously toxic again. <laughs> What did you say about toxic monsters, Draven? Oh, hey, don't worry about it. 
you're smiling evilly and rubbing your hands together. Just psyched about the party. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go to the graveyard and dig up more toxic slime. <laughs> what? Say what? A figure of speech. Later, Gators. I'm not 100% sure about that guy. You mean there's not gonna be a bouncy castle? Welcome to my birthday bash! Try the Draven Driven Challenge! Do your best tricks to land in the bouncy castle and win a surprise that is totally not evil! Pinky promise! Fun party! Yeah, although those giant monsters are kind of harshing my vibe. <laughs> Sophia Speed! Fastest driver in Hot Wheels City! Second fastest. After me. Come on, Elliot. We can win this thing! really not a surprise. <laughs> I was kind of hoping it would be ice cream. Since no one's around to have ice cream, I guess you guys get it all. <laughs> My favorite flavor, toxic slime. Enjoy. <laughs> Thinking what I'm thinking? If vampires can't see their reflection, why does their hair always look so neat? No, but that actually kind of makes sense. I'm thinking we've got to help her. <laughs> Those monsters are fast. Even Sophia Speed can't outrun them. And she's the fastest driver in Hot Wheels City. Well, that's debatable. Lots of people are saying I'm the fastest. Who says that? A lot of very smart people. We don't have time for that now, Elliot. I have an idea of how to stop those monsters. Follow me and stay frosty. Come get us, you big, ugly, toxic monsters! Uh, no need to get them even angrier, Elliot. Cream brain freeze, classic. Plus, sugar crash. Toxic monster meltdown, complete. Thanks, boys. I owe you one. You're welcome, Sophia Speed, fastest driver in Hot Wheels City. Second, shouldn't have to keep saying that. You meddling misfits may have stopped my monsters, but nothing can stop me. Okay, a giant toxic snake with ice cream brain freeze can maybe stop me, but not for long! Silly toxic monsters. turning people into zombies, which is not something you hear on the news every day. Unless you live in Hot Wheels City. Hey, Quinn, you know what's more fun than a bunch of zombies crashing into everything? No, what? Literally everything. Echo. So what's the plan again? Draven made the slime. He's going to help us get rid of it. 
Draven's not usually super helpful, really more of an insane evil genius type guy. Plus, isn't he in some sort of zero-g prison? Leave that to me. So, what sort of brilliant high-tech plan do you have to break Draven out? Probably some quantum phys ed type stuff, huh? Something like that. Stay right behind me. Draven, get in. Hey, what's up? We're busting you out of here if you stop the slime. Uh, Quinn, we got hot zombie fuzz. Brace yourselves. I'm punching the black hole donut duster. I knew she'd have some kind of brilliant high-tech plan. Pickles. Wait, did you say black hole? Some slime antidote. Ooh, hey. What's up? The effects of prolonged zero G may have altered his brain chemistry. And definitely not the fact that we just drove through a black hole. Oh. The only thing that can reverse zero G scramble brains is the super driver's testing loop. Just need to get past all those zombies. How did they even get their license? I'll draw them off. Get to the loop. What's that? Might have to get my wheels rebalanced. Got that nice, fresh zombie car smell. I think Draven's had enough testing with action. What's your name? Uh, Quinn Cosmic. Hmm, he still seems to be suffering from zero G. You're Draven. Evil genius? Do you remember anything that would help us reverse the slime? Anything at all? Think! Hmm. Nope. Not ringing any bells. Pickles! No, buddy. Those aren't pickles. Those are just a bunch of barrels of zombie reversing slime hidden beneath a tarp. Zombie reversing serum? Draven must have hidden it for himself. Well, that's shockingly convenient. But why did he hide it here? Who cares? Let's get this antidote out there. One City D-Slime. Good to have you back. I'm hungry. Can we get burgers? I want extra pickles. Uh, how about pizza? Hey, Elliot, guess what I'm doing? Cleaning my rear view, because I'll be watching a lot of you in it when I win the biggest race of the year and the key to the city. Well, guess what I'm doing, Chase? Cleaning my rear view, because it's... Kinda dirty. Sophia Speed, fastest driver in Hot Wheels City. How many times do I need to go over this? I'm the fastest. But she always beats you. Doesn't mean she's the fastest. It kinda does. No one's going to beat my slime supercharger. The key to Hot Wheels City will soon be mine. <laughs> then all will tremble before my power! <laughs> right. 
Is that Draven? And what's with the glowing rims? I wouldn't worry. He's the slowest driver in Hot Wheels City. Just got a new special topic, slimy evil genius. Doesn't mean she's the fastest. She just beat everyone in the biggest race of the year, so... Gonna believe your eyes, Elliot, or what I'm telling you? Congratulations! You win the key to the city! <laughs> I've got the key to the city, Lamos! Shouldn't we go after him? He has the key to the entire city! <laughs> we figured Draven would do something like that. That key doesn't actually open anything. This is the real key. Yeah. This stupid key doesn't open anything. I wanted free ice cream for life. Give me that cone, kid. <laughs> I could say, curses, foiled again. But I foiled myself. That's a self-foil. <laughs> Come on, boys. Ice cream's on me. To the ice cream. I'm getting there first, cuz I'm the fastest! Not according to science. New news! Draven, Hot Wheel City's resident evil genius, is having a birthday bash and inviting his giant toxic monster pals. What could possibly go wrong? Say what? Draven's getting back together with his toxic monster pals? Yeah, it's his birthday, and he said those are his only friends. And they're not toxic anymore. Everyone got the antidote, remember? I don't know about this, Chase. And what about the bouncy castle? There's gonna be a bouncy castle? Awesome! Oh, don't worry, my pets. You will soon be monstrously toxic again. <laughs> What did you say about toxic monsters, Draven? Oh, hey, don't worry about it. 
you're smiling evilly and rubbing your hands together. Just psyched about the party. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go to the graveyard and dig up more toxic slime. <laughs> what? Say what? A figure of speech. Later, Gators. I'm not 100% sure about that guy. You mean there's not going to be a bouncy castle? Welcome to my birthday bash! Try the Draven Driven Challenge! Do your best tricks to land in the bouncy castle and win a surprise that is totally not evil! Pinky promise! Fun party! Yeah, although those giant monsters are kind of harshing my vibe. <laughs> Sophia Speed! Fastest driver in Hot Wheels City! Second fastest. After me. Come on, Elliot. We can win this thing! Did we win? What's our surprise? Surprise! You're fools! Actually, that's really not a surprise. <laughs> I was kind of hoping it would be ice cream. Since no one's around to have ice cream, I guess you guys get it all. <laughs> My favorite flavor, toxic slime. Enjoy! <laughs> Sophia Speed! Are you thinking what I'm thinking? If vampires can't see their reflection, why does their hair always look so neat? No, but that actually kind of makes sense. I'm thinking we've got to help her. <laughs> Those monsters are fast. Even Sophia Speed can't outrun them. And she's the fastest driver in Hot Wheels City. Well, that's debatable. Lots of people are saying I'm the fastest. Who says that? A lot of very smart people. We don't have time for that now, Elliot. I have an idea of how to stop those monsters. Follow me and stay frosty. Come get us, you big, ugly, toxic monsters! Uh, no need to get them even angry. Ice cream brain freeze, classic. Plus, sugar crash. Toxic monster meltdown, complete. Thanks, boys. I owe you one. You're welcome, Sophia Speed. Fastest driver in Hot Wheels City. Second. Shouldn't have to keep saying that. You meddling misfits may have stopped my monsters, but nothing can stop me! Okay. A giant toxic snake with ice cream brain freeze can maybe stop me, but not for long! Silly, toxic monsters. Hey, Elliot. Notice anything unusual? My fingers are all different lengths. No, the cars. The colors are gone. What is happening? Only my most evil plan yet! A decolorizer laser to make all the cars in Hot Wheels City two-toned, boring tire draggers! <laughs> Races will stop, stunting will cease, flashy cars will be rendered... Uh, not so flashy! Uh, what's that, Toxic Snake? A decolorizer is just a working title. Kicking around a lot of really cool evil names. <laughs> we need 
to outrun that boring bee. Got it! I call that the laser looper. Ray Gun Ricochet! Um, why aren't we racing, Elliot? Forward Force feels weird without its pavement-pounding purple set off against Goju's gold glitter. I don't feel like going forward with Force. I know what you mean. Without the blow-the-doors-off black body and a road rash red trim, I don't even feel like shifting, Night Shifter. Hey, guys. How's life in the slow lane? Boring. I'll just race myself, since I'm the only one who could ever beat me. Cool. What else? <laughs> Twin mill! I thought you were racing. Without the Rage and Red and Titanium Tire Shaker rims, Twin Mill is just run of the mill. Draven, I bet he's draining the car colors. Soon, he'll be the fastest and coolest driver. Yes. See? That's my evil plan. Told you I had one. <laughs> Who's laughing now? <laughs> Anyone seen Draven? Notice a big ray gun anywhere? So this is how our fabled racing careers end. Obeying the speed limit. <sighs> First gear for life. Take your time, kid. We're in no rush. Bad news, guys. I can't find Draven. Looks like we're gonna be boring forever. What's she pointing at? The car wash? That's it! Cars always end up at the car wash as they began. Clean and colorful is new. So, do you think that'll make our cars cool again? Only one way to find out. Got it! Not a second to lose! Not so fast! I mean, slow. I'm now the fastest driver in Hot Wheels City! I'm getting past that snake. Eventually. Hmm. Didn't we used to do something awesome and gnarly in situations like this? Before we were boring, didn't we used to go fast? Fly the tires! Punish the pedal! Rock the throttle! We need more torque! There's only one thing to do! The Hot Wheel City Drift! Dude, that's legendary! But dangerous. You mess that move up, you could drift forever! We got one chance at this! Now! Spin cycle! I call that... Good one, Elliot. Too bad, Draven. Looks like you're officially still the slowest and uncoolest driver in Hot Wheels City. Looks like Hot Wheels City is back to normal. Almost normal. That ain't normal. Nope. Nothing beats a trip to the Mega Garage, right, Elliot? Agreed, Chase. It's like going on a vacation with your favorite person who's actually a car. Dude, that is poetic. This parking attendant kind of looks familiar. Yeah, because it's Draven. No, I'm not. I'm Graven. You just changed one letter. Hey, man, lay off Graven. He's just doing his job. Keep up the good work, G-Man. Can we grab a ticket? You won't need a ticket because you're never leaving. <laughs> What'd you say about never leaving? Oh, uh, nothing. It was a pun. Cool garage. Yeah, it's 
like a disco for cars. Park, chill, and check out the whips. What's that? Sophia Speed, fastest driver in Hot Wheels City. After me. Boys, it's time we settled this once and for all. I challenge you to a race to see who's the fastest. You better find another gear in that snoozer cruiser of your speed, because my dragger has volcanoes for valves. And my dragger has... Uh, valve volcanoes. You can't brag my brag, Elliot. We'll be right down. Hey, I thought we were going down. Yeah, this is where we started. Those are the cars we were just looking at. I don't know about this, Chase. Come on, Sophia's waiting. Now we're on the roof. I could swear we were going down that time. What is happening? Welcome to Draven's. Uh, I, um, I mean, Graven's Mega Mirage Garage. Hope you enjoy it, because you're going to spend eternity in there, you two idiots. What was that about us being idiots? Did I say idiots? I meant imbeciles. This is getting freaky. Let's split up. You go up, I'll go down. You get the feeling we're driving around in circles? You get the feeling we're driving around in circles? You can say that again. I just did. How do we get out of this gnarly garage? Don't panic. We do what we always do when faced with a seemingly impossible situation that requires careful planning and delicate maneuvering. Pump the pedal and drive like crazy? Took the words right out of my mouth. Well, that didn't work. I'd like to go back to before we drove in. That's it! There's only one way to get back somewhere car-wise. What's that? Reverse gear! And we're back! Nice try, Graven but we escaped your mega mirage garage. Yeah, and Graven, tell Draven, Chase and Elliot say, nice try. <sighs> Sorry we took so long, Sophia. We were stuck in a mega garage mirage. What are you talking about? It's only been a minute. Oh, right. Cool. The race is on, so you better bring the heat speed. And also, you better drive really fast. You're the worst evil genius ever. You are. Uh -huh. I'm a parking lot attendant. No, you're me with a different name tag. You guys know where I parked. New news! You want giant toxic monsters rampaging around? We got them! Giant toxic T-Rex! <laughs> Supersized toxic snake! At your service! Way too big toxic gorilla! Present! Now, Sheriff, how are you planning on taking back the city? Me? You are the Sheriff. So, what I'm planning to do is, uh... <laughs> Chase and Elliot! You see, that was my plan all along. Sure. Don't worry, Sheriff. We'll round up those maniacal monsters before you can say, pedal to the metal. Pedal to the metal. Okay, how about before you can say, pop a wheelie? Or fry the tires. You can try and stop my monsters, but this time, things aren't exactly what they appear to be. Isn't that right, Giant Snake? 
Oh, why don't you pay a surprise visit to those fools and say a big, evil hello from Draven? No, uh, oh, sure, I realize you don't speak. Just uh, hiss or something. Where are the monsters? There! Where? Magic disappearing snake. I don't know, but I've got an idea. Draven's monsters are back, so let's get rid of them this time, just like we did the last time. Good thinking. It's deja vu all over again. Hey, you big ugly reptile, over here! And that's how we deja do. We softened him up. One more should do the trick. Giant toxic snake. Check. Giant toxic gorilla. Check. Only one more to go. Wait, let me guess. Giant toxic T-Rex. Let's hope our airbags work. Can use a hand or a bumper. Giant toxic monsters defeated. Deja done. Not so fast, fellas. Looks like Draven's using some sort of. Hey, where did they come from? Again. Can't they take a hint? I was just saying. Looks like Draven's using some sort of slime teleporter to move his monsters around. Don't worry. We've got things totally under control. Yeah, totally. Hey, Chase, what's the exact opposite of totally? Come on, we gotta deja do this all over again. No use. They just keep teleporting over and over again. Yep, definitely deja doting it. Wait a minute. That's it. They keep teleporting, and we can use that to our advantage. Chase, Elliot, let's do the monster maneuver. Keep circling the city! Get those monsters as close as possible to each other! That is one major monster mix-up! Speaking of the same thing happening again and again, where did Draven go? You may have mashed my monsters for now, but the fun is only beginning. And by fun, I mean not fun at all, because things are about to get real evil. Uh-oh. Ow. Any minute now. Very, very evil. Oh. Can someone get these monsters off me? <laughs> Here's some new news for you. Hot Wheels City is under the ultimate attack by my monsters! And Draven is using his most evil plan ever. A toxic slime teleporter. Huh? How does everyone know about my most evil plan ever? It looks like he accidentally filmed himself from his lair and our newsfeed picked it up. Oh, yes. I did do that. Oopsie. about enough of these giant toxic monsters. At least it can't get much worse. Boys, it just got much worse. <laughs> nope, wrong again. Hey, Quinn's back. I've got a plan. You guys need to lure Draven out of his evil lair. Okay, 
but we'll need one thing for that to work. So via speed. You mean? Yep. After all, she's the fastest driver in Hot Wheels City. Wow. Never thought you'd admit it. Do you think this is the place? Well, it's creepy. Sinister. And definitely dark and foreboding. And look! There's a giant toxic snake! Definitely an evil lair! Hey, what's going on? I'm trying to do evil lair stuff in here! You kids, get off my evil lawn! Hey, my toxic slime teleporter! Give it back! You'll have to catch the fastest driver in Hot Wheels City first, Draven! New news! The biggest high-speed chase in Hot Wheels City history is on! know that even my remote has a remote and they're all heading into a trap this just in everyone's heading into a trap what how did she know that oh i filmed myself again it doesn't matter it's too late <laughs> took the remote. <laughs> now, my monsters will destroy your cars once and for all. Then, I'm going to drive around in La Fasta, which will officially be the fastest and coolest car in Hot Wheels City. Get a picture of me winning. You're actually going somewhere very far away, Draven. Megadrome! No! There! You tricked me! I'll be back! You can't stop Draven! Looks like we'll all be hanging around Hot Wheels City a little longer. So, Chase, I heard you said I was the fastest driver in Hot Wheels City. We all said a lot of things. But you drove pretty well against those toxic monsters. So did you. You might be the fastest for now, but just wait until I get my new ride. That's the beauty of Hot Wheels City. Anyone can be the fastest. Hey, Chase. How are you going to beat me in the big race if you can't beat me to the ultimate garage in our practice race? Skill, Elliot. Pure skill. Come on, Chase! <laughs> hey, hey, G-Ride subscribers, my G-Riders. It's Maria G, live at the biggest race ever. This race is so big, it's going to take three days to finish. This Hot Wheels City course is wild. High Bank, Devil's Loop. Impossible jump. And straight away that pit driver against driver and car against car. And what's the prize for the driver crowned fastest in the world? Well, I'll let Mayor Chen of Hot Wheel City, coolest mayor ever, tell you herself. Thank you, Maria. Aside from bragging rights, the winner will receive this. The one and only Hot Wheels City Key of Awesomeness that unlocks all the awesome power of Hot Wheels City. Did you hear that? I'm 
gonna get the key of awesomeness. Get? No, but I promise I'll let you hold it after I win. Don't know what you're talking about, Chase. It's either gonna be my nitro fuel injectors or Sophia's fast driving that'll win this race. <laughs> Cha. Dream on, dudes. That key is mine. I already have a keychain for it. How are you gonna beat me, Elliot? Did you replace your engine with the Tetra Flame? <laughs> <sighs> Nobody could handle that much power. That's our cue. Look at that motor muscle at the starting line. This is the biggest race ever. In three days, we'll know for sure who the world's fastest driver is. But for the next five seconds, it's anybody's race. <laughs> Woohoo! Mm. Yeah! And yet, here comes the air fryer. Dude, what does that even mean? I don't know. You guys are making me hungry. For victory. left to clap when I win the race. If we don't stop that gorilla, there won't be a city left to race in. Challenge accepted. New news, G-Riders. If you thought the race was today's biggest story, meh, wrong. Today's biggest story, a giant gorilla attacking Hot Wheels City. Hang back and watch the best. Thanks for introducing me, bro. I'll be done by the time you get there. Sorry, girlfriend. But I got him wrapped up this time. Hey! Tall Blue and Harry! Time to go home! It's brains over brawn this time, Sophia!
their driving is jacked! Wow, that was amazing. Who carries banana peels in their car? Potassium. Keeps you sharp. Ugh. Where's he going? The finish line! Not if I have anything to say about it. Along with our thanks for single-handedly saving the city. Like we didn't help? First place after day one of the biggest race ever goes to the Cosmic Coupe and its mysterious driver. Navard. Even his name is cool. Tomorrow's leg of the race will start late while the track is repaired. Go Hot Wheels City! That'll give you four extra time to learn how to drive. <laughs> Sorry, I just couldn't resist. Hey, thanks for keeping that gorilla busy till I got here. Ha! Sure thing! Good luck tomorrow! Good luck? He stole the race. Technically, he didn't steal it. He showed up late, defeated a giant gorilla, and won it while I was distracted. And his car's super cool. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. He sort of came out of nowhere. Hmm. Last one back to the ultimate garage is a busted blinker. Somebody forget how to get out of first gear speed! Are you gonna let him talk to you like that, Sophia? I let my car do the talking. <laughs> Coming through loud and clear. <laughs> huh? Hard? <laughs> Don't tell me I'm late for my tour of the Ultimate Garage. No way. We're just on the way to our pre-race tune-up. Wait a minute. Who invited him? Uh, I, I did. did. What's the matter? Don't tell me you're jealous of Navard's tech. More like mystified. Sophia, you know I've seen all the tech there is, and I've never seen anything like his. <laughs> Amazing. It's just as awesome as I've always heard. And wow, the Tetra Flame. Super cool, right? <laughs> oh yeah. What do you do with it? Keep it safe and watch it power Hot Wheel City's awesomeness. Are these extra large air intakes custom? My own design. <laughs> How did you integrate the garage systems? That's all Quinn. She's the big tech genius around here. Even designed a state of the art security system. Totally over my head. Is that a portable fusion reactor? Elliot, huh. your password is your name. Navard, happy to help you check your gear ratios, injectors, shift computers. Thanks, but um, I do it all myself. Huh, you're a one-man band, Navard. Hey, hey, G-Riders! It's your girl, Maria G, at Hot Wheel City's rad new police station with Sheriff Tony Nyong'o. Sheriff, what are you and your team doing to pump up the safety volume? After yesterday's gorilla attack, we've secured various sections of the track. High bank, doubles loops, straightaway, and of course, everyone here at the station is on high alert. Our squad car launch is ready for action, and our communications team is ready to put out the emergency call. I don't know about you, T-Riders, but this fangirl feels safer already. And ready to watch day two of the biggest race ever, yo! Oh, 
Access the Tetra Flame. I need a key? What key? Ah, that key. The key of awesomeness. You're mine, creepy crawl! It's not the Parabutha Scorpion. They shoot venom. Then watch a nature network chase? It's educational! Uh, we might want to chat later. That thing's got the sheriff trapped. Did you see that? It's big, but clumsy. And we're little but fast. We should be able to trip it up easy. Then let's bring it down. Wait, are we sure it's not the, the Parababa whatever? Okay, challenge accepted. Frisbee! <laughs> Can't catch me! Gotta be faster than that, Scorpy! Nope! Uh-uh! I've got this. That was amazing. Not really. You all distracted him for me. Yeah, team effort. Kind of. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got somewhere else to be. Sure thing. Where? The finish line. The race! I can't believe he's doing it again. Not if the twin mill has anything to vroom about it. Look out, boys. This one's mine. Sorry, Speed. I got this. Here come the leaders, G-Riders. Oh, let it go! Twin mills on two wheels! Day two of the biggest race ever is wicked! Dynamic acrobatics happening right now. But can they slingshot it first? Uh, it's Cosmic Coop by a wiper blade! Cosmic Coop wins day two of the biggest race ever! Incredible! 
Oh, well, my girl Sophia Speed and La Fasta and Tooligan tied for second. <laughs> it's amazing. Fast Fish and Twin Mill take the fourth spot and fifth. <laughs> Woohoo! I'd like to see him beat me in a fair race. Hey, it's not Navard's fault giant creatures attack the course. Come on, you have to admit it's a little weird. No, me coming in fifth is what's weird. Don't worry, there's always tomorrow. And that means another chance to come in second after me. <laughs> hey, hey, G-Riders. Check out my drone eye view of the first lap of the last day of the biggest race ever. Fast fish has fast lead. But hello, Twin Mills not letting his best bro waste a sec. Tooligan and Cosmic Coop take the lead. Oh, but hold up, my girl Sophia, the sorceress of speed, has muscled La Fasta into the lead. And she is gonna need all that speed if she's gonna burn up Cosmic Coop's lead from days one and two. Yes. <laughs> huh? G-Riders, I don't know if you saw that shadow, but it looked to me like... Let me guess. A fire-breathing dragon. A fire-breathing dragon? What? I was joking! Whoa! That's not good. Oh, no. Look out! Those are big claws. They're called talents? You watch them. Way too much nature network. Mm. Look! Whoa! Huh? Uh-oh! The ultimate garage! We've got to stop! What the race? No, it's the ultimate garage! But I'm winning! There are people in there. Uh-huh. <sighs> You're right. Challenge accepted. She put plenty of air in those tires. She's gonna need a lot of bounce in those babies. That's it! It is? Bounce! Tires! We can break her fall with tires! On it! Makes sense. I mean, those folks are totally anti-fire. Let's go! Over here! Where are the firefighters? Across town fighting a warehouse fire. Help! Come on! With 
what? Hoses. Exactly. I know you've heard this from me before, but... We need a blast of fast. Isn't this about the time Navard should arrive to save the day? I don't trust that guy. Me neither. Come on, he's great. Did you see how cool his helmet is? Yeah, but this job's up to us. We can do it, believe it. Stand still now! driving under the most unusual of circumstances, I award you the Hot Wheels City Key of Awesomeness. The key that unleashes all of Hot Wheels City's awesomeness. The key that opens everything. Thank you, Mayor Chen. Rest assured, I will use it wisely. There you are. How'd you like my dragon? Pretty cool, right? Your dragon? <laughs> well, yeah. Every villain needs a dragon. Draven? Draven? Cool young Draven. How is that possible? Seriously. Navard Draven spelled backward. <laughs> Honestly, I thought it was too obvious. <gasps> You're a clone. I prefer new model. And with the key of awesomeness and the Tetra Flame, I'll be making a new Hot Wheels city. My Hot Wheels city. Dante, time to fly. I can't believe Navard lied to us like that. I thought he was really cool. That's what he wanted you to think. And he was pretty good at it. I'm sorry we didn't believe you, Quinn. Yeah, we should have listened. It's okay, guys. We still had each other's backs. Tcha! That crazy Navard could destroy the city. And I gave him the key. What are we going to do? What we do best. Drive! Keep up! We gotta get to the ultimate garage fast! Don't have to honk at me twice! Hey, hey, G-Riders! It's Maria G with the G-Ride! If you're just logging in, Navard, the mysterious winner of the biggest race ever, revealed himself to be a super secret super clone of arch villain Draven and flew off to the ultimate garage on a dragon. I mean, a dragon. Who does that? Too bad he's a bad guy. But some big cues remain. Why did Draven unleash his crazy clone? What are Draven's evil plans? How does the ultimate garage fit in? Keep checking in, G-Riders. More to come. I've got a blast of fast in the garage to save. Hoping there'll be a garage to save. Who knows what Navard's done to it since. Scorpion! I know we didn't win the big. 
biggest race ever, but I'm pretty sure we beat this thing. Then we can do it again. Serpentine! Monster's gonna have a monster headache when it wakes up. Yeah, let's not be here for that. Well, the ultimate garage is still standing. Yeah, but unfortunately, so are they. Surprised? You didn't think you'd actually beaten them, did you? <laughs> Like what I've done with the place? Not really. Why is it glowing? Did you mess with my systems, Navard? Let's say improved. You never understood the power of the Tetra Flame. No, you don't understand the power. Now give it back like a good evil clone. I think that was a no. This isn't over, Navard. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's... Yes, it is! <laughs> no, it's not. We need a new place to regroup and figure out a plan. I'm still trying to figure out how we hacked into our old place. I have the security system totally encrypted. Tell me about it. It was so complicated, I had to write my password on a post-it. Well, that answers that question. Now where do we go? Hey, I know a spot. Follow me. with giant jets of water is the perfect place for sensitive electronic equipment, but I can make it work. Let me know what you need from me, Quinn. Thanks, Elliot. Here's a mop. <laughs> no. An instant color change station. Color reveal station. It reveals the alternate colors hidden inside the paint's molecular structure. Structure, molecule, blah, blah. What it is, is cool. I couldn't help myself. I know what I want for my birthday. I wish we could figure out why Navard's powering up the Tetra Flame as easily as I figured this out. Looks like we've got something else to figure out first. And the latest totally bizarro happening in Hot Wheels City is the sudden appearance of this giant ice cream cone right in the middle of the intersection of High and Star Streets. Hmm, <sighs> chocolate. The latest? Better check it out. With a blast of fast. Look out back there. Wheels up! Ice cream truck! Our building just disappeared! We need to get off this street! Sheriff's got barricades there. Up ahead, too! A detour sign! map this detour. That would be me, I'm afraid. Draven? Yes. You tricked us here. Trapping you was the only way I could think of getting you to listen to me. Why should we listen to you? You did all this. It's all your fault. I didn't do any of this. I just returned to Hot Wheels City. It's my clones doing. 
And who cloned you? I don't know. That's why I need to talk to you. So, you're not using your clone to distract us while you execute an even more horrible plan. Oh, I wish I was, but no. There's only one place we can all get some answers to this weird stuff happening. All? Are you saying we should team up with Draven? He's a bad guy. Elliot, the enemy of your enemy is your friend. At least for a while. Agreed. If we're coming from the south on the track, they won't know how many of us there are until we're there. Leaving us the element of surprise. I like it. Uh, bro, you're giving him all our secret moves. We'll think of new ones. Let's do this. <laughs> Surprise part right. Now we just have to look at We're gonna need bigger cars. And maybe a boat. to some kind of interdimensional nexus, or a genie! I know what my first wish would be! More of these loops! How about we move this discussion to dry land? I thought this was dry land! Follow me! At your pace, do we have a choice? Dragon? Don't be late for supper. Super Shark! No way, Miha. Your four-wheel blog is grounded. We don't mess with the sharks. I'll try to tap in, because missing this super shark action is killing me! Finn's coming in fast! I know my car's called Fast Fish, but I don't want to be fish food. Uh, it's gone. Is anybody else freaked out? Yes. Phew, I thought it was just me. Put your mega minds together on the garage. On it! And hurry! My car's not short this! Let's give them something to do. I'll take the dragon, you take the gorilla, and I'll meet you at impossible show. Roger that! Amplifier? That's why the whole building's glowing. He's using the Tetra Flame to suck power from the entire city. Where are we taking this thing? On a wild fish chase. Awesome! I hope Quinn gets some answers, because at some point, we're gonna run out of gas. And Soul's Hot Wheel City. Look! Oh! 
Blossom out of Hot Wheels City. Why does he need so much power? I don't know, but it's so hot it can melt my systems. He must be using a cryo shield to regulate the temperature. Yeah, but computers aren't designed for extreme heat or cold. Neither are sharks. <laughs> Genius. Hmm. Why, thank you. That's a great compliment coming from you. Likewise. But after this is over, we go back to being enemies. Arch enemies. Let's go help the others. Well, this is awkward. Fastest driver in Hot Wheels City and all. Second fastest. We'll discuss that later. When it goes for one of us, the others should ram it. Shark's nose is his weak spot. <laughs> Suddenly, I'm glad you're watching so much Nature Network. Don't think we can keep this up forever. Yeah, I'm hungry. I'm so hungry, I, I think I hear the ice cream truck. You do? Look. Super cool freeze ray ice cream truck. Don't suppose there's any ice cream in it. Q's always prepared. Got a plan? If we could trick the shark into leaping all the way out of the ground, I can take it down. Challenge, Challenge accepted. So, uh, how exactly is making the shark cold gonna help us? Is it because sharks are ectothermic? Ecto bubble what what what? Ectothermic means their body temperature is dependent on the temperature around them. If we can cool it down super fast, it won't be able to teleport below the ground. Then let's go to the sky pad. Good thinking. That's so high, it'll have to jump all the way out of the ground to get us there. Come and get us, shark boy! Hit it, Quinn, hit it! Maria G, but you can't stop her from droning. The G rides back in action. What do you say we not be here when this thing falls out? Anybody want to get sushi? Maybe later. We caught the shark, but there's still another fish to fry. A bad one. We're coming for you, Navard. <laughs> 